Hey toy collectors, let's talk about DC Multiverse's The Signal. Duke Thomas, also known as The Signal, is relatively new to the Bat family in terms of their history overall, but he has been around for quite some time. I love the figure and the way it looks in the packaging. I love his costume as well. Let's go ahead and open him up. And here he is. He comes with two Escrima sticks, a card that has a brief bio on the back, and a nice nifty stand. A lot of people are not a fan of Signal's costume. Personally, though, I think it stands out, and I like it a lot. Being that this is a McFarlane figure, he has tons of articulation, but with all McFarlane figures, you gotta be careful about moving him too much. Regardless, though, overall, I think this is a really well-done figure. I know it probably would have been a bit too much. I would have liked to have been able to take off his helmet, just so you can see his face a bit better. Here's a view from the back, so you can get a good view of what he really looks like. Here's comparison with the Duke Thomas from the DC Multiverse line, you can see the McFarlane figures are far larger in comparison. Still though, I do like this version of Duke. I don't have a lot of McFarlane toys to show next to the signal. I don't even have a Batman. I do have a Midnighter. That's pretty close though, right? And of course, I have several versions of Tim Drake, Robin, my boy. He's the coolest Robin of all of them. As for the signal, I think he looks incredibly cool. And if you're a fan of his character, this is a toy I think you would want to pick up. Anyways though, I'm going to end this toy quickie review at this point. Be sure to check out my Patreon site, my social media sites, my websites, and everything else out there. Peace, love, the mouse, and I'll join you guys later. Peace.